Hi everybody! Welcome to my vlog! Oh my goodness, it has been so long since I have made a video and I'm terribly, terribly sorry. Um, a lot of things have been going on. Um, as you can see, I am in a new background. I am in, back in school and I've got my room all set up and here I am. There's the door of my dresser. Um, yeah, so I've been moving and I've also been having some complications with my laptop just now, um, getting it to connect to the internet like all the time. It would connect for a little bit and then it would stop and it's been a whole ordeal, but I finally got it to work so now I can continue making videos for you guys. Um, yes, I'm very, very excited about it. Kind of what my video is going to be about, um, is, uh, the board of directors. Um, that's kind of also kind of why I haven't been uh, making videos. Um, and so I'm going to talk a little bit about that. Um, where do you start though? Okay, so I guess I'll start with me. Uh, I um, had an incident while I was here. I, as soon as I got here, I um, back to school. My school is two hours away from where I live. and I do not have a car, so I have no way of getting back home. Um, other than my mom picking me up or my boyfriend picking me up, um, and they're both two hours away, and basically, um, I've pretty much, you know, when I first got to, to school freshman year, I had all the excitement, and I was meeting people and doing stuff, um, so that really helped me not be homesick and miss my, my mother, um, and then, like, two, three months into my uh, freshman year, I met my boyfriend, and we have basically been inseparable, we we're always together, um, that was one of the exciting things about going back to school, is that we got to hang out again, and uh, he just graduated, which is, of course, amazing, definitely so happy for him, but that leaves me here at school, um, and I didn't really realize how homesick I'd be, uh, just because I, you know, my, my two most important people in my life, my boyfriend, my mother, are two hours away. I have no way of getting to them. Um, it kind of put a lot on me and that we had moved in early. Um, so there wasn't much going on, no school or anything like that. Um, mostly just been, mostly was just kind of hanging out, getting stuff organized and things like that. Um, so I was kind of going through a little bit of, I don't even know how to explain it. Um, just was feeling really, really low. I even had to go home for the weekend um, just to, you know, make myself feel better. Um, I was like physically, like my, my, I was so emotionally sick that I was like becoming physically sick. So um, that was definitely kind of scary to go through. Um, but, you know, luckily I'm doing a lot better. School started. I'm doing really well in my classes and, um, you know, everything's, uh, going well. Um, my boyfriend has been visiting me. He's visiting me this weekend and, um, you know, just been hanging out, trying to meet new people, um, you know, exercising, trying to eat healthy, just trying to do, uh, just trying to, you know, do everything. I'm trying to get myself busy, you know, and just kind of focus on, at school and you know you know just kind of focus on this you know it's just one part of my life that I have to get through in order to get to the next part of my life so which is what I was talking about in one of my uh, in one of uh, my classes um, we talked about a uh, board of directors and it was in my entrepreneurship class and basically um, it, my teacher was telling us about how we need to have um, you know certain people in our life who um, help us achieve our goals um, and he was talking about more in business you know, the way that I want to talk about it is, um, for your self-love and your confidence in yourself, I feel like you also need, um, a board of directors. Um, like for example, my board of directors, I have three people in my board of directors. I am a company. I am an entity that needs people to, you know, help me, help me keep going. That's number one. Um, you know, probably the vice president of my company is of course my mother um she's always there for me 
always um, supporting me no matter, no matter what I do. And um, when I was going through a rough time, she was really there for me. She would stay up with me all night talking on the phone, even though she was tired and had to go to work. And she drove two hours to come pick me up just so I could be at home for a few days to make me feel better. Um, you know, so I would I would you know obviously be where I am today. She's raised me um, with very little support her whole life, or my whole life, <laughs> her whole life, uh, for my whole life. And um, yeah, she's definitely um, you know she's that person that um, makes me believe in myself. Um, next on my board of directors is my boyfriend. Uh, he's also been very supportive. We've been dating for almost three years. He came out to visit me as soon as he could, and he's coming back, um, which definitely helps me feel less homesick. Um, and, you know, obviously, um, a you know, significant other will make you feel uh, good about yourself. Hopefully, if, if they're not, then you definitely need to reconsider. Um, you know, a relationship should make you feel uh, happy and um, make you feel more worthy. You know, my boyfriend definitely makes me feel, um, gives me that little boost of self-confidence just to know that, you know, there's someone that's there for me who loves me for who I am, cares about me, you know, the whole spiel. Um, and then lastly on board of directors is my best friend, Jasmine. And she's also my roommate this year. And, um, she also helped me through my rough time, um, uh, you know, just reassuring me that she is here for me and, um, you know, we're roommates, so we spend a great, great deal of time together, and whenever I'm having frustrations or a good day, um, you know, she's usually the first person I talk to, so I just want to advise you to, um, have those people in your life that, um, really kind of motivate you to be better, whether it be in school or help you with your self-confidence, you know, the people that tell you that you're an amazing person, that you're a beautiful person, um, and always, always, if there are people in your life that are telling you the opposite, that are making you feel bad about yourself, you got to distance yourself from those people and, um, you know, continue to be on the path of, you know, I'm a good person. I'm a beautiful person. Um, you know, I have people who care about me, who love me, who need me, who, you know, want me to do the best I can in my life. So um, I definitely advise everyone to definitely 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 think about getting a board of directors in your in your business will your business be you know your business of your life because <laughs> it's just as important to have a board of directors in your life I think um just to keep you just to keep you sane keep you on that path I really thank you all for watching I promise you promise you now that all of my all of the things going on in my life are back together I will be making videos. I am going to make a promise to you right now that I'm going to make new videos every week. So definitely subscribe. Definitely. Definitely uh, subscribe for more videos. And um, don't forget to uh, follow my Tumblr for uh, all kinds of tips on everything. And um, is there anything else? Oh my goodness. Facebook, uh, Twitter, just go everywhere. Just do all of that stuff and <laughs> definitely watch my next video uh, and you know if you have any suggestions for what kind of vlogs you want to see or anything just uh, leave a comment so thank you all for watching see you guys next time